peace and love zero 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 on the clock sending you all positive energy high vibes success on your entrepreneurship all love all positivity today i'm going to be speaking about the energy of life path five i also have a video on the introduction of life paths and what it's symbolic to it lets you know your true divinity and your soul mission to see out on the planet once we have an understanding of the numbers it lets us know our energy our personal experiences our personalities and also the knowledge of the collective consciousness as a whole and it's also how the ancient ancestors the higher powers connect with us and guide us to greatness okay no number is bad all numbers has their unique talent also meaning just as well as us with our soul purpose we all have a unique talent that's brewing inside of us that we have to access in order to reach soul evolution and tap into our true divinity of the essence of the soul okay make sure you subscribe to my youtube channel you hit the like button and you leave me any comments or questions in my description below life path fives has beautiful energy and to think about it the celebrities that holds life path five energy jay-z also beyonce what a coincidence they both hold life path fives <laughs> or kelly as well okay when we think of five five is symbolic to freedom spontaneity freedom okay i got freedom twice travel adventure a higher level of consciousness to perceive okay great power because it helps us to tap into the essence of the soul when we think of five we have our five senses that guides us to greatness if we operate out of them five senses they're going to take us to beautiful places they're going to place us in the harmonizing field of love they're also going to place us in the present moment and that's where we create the beautiful things the most and also in the harmonizing field to connect with divine oneness and also tap into the laws of attraction 222 is on my clock <laughs> and i have 55 degrees so it's 55 degrees where i'm at at this moment as well so the fives the power is amplified so also we think about um the pentagram with the five angles is connected with the five senses also the five elements three 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 on the clock adding ether earth air fire water ether is all so it's the structure of the earth to have balance also it connects us with our five senses the body part if we think about our body we have the two arms the two legs and the head the main part of the body five parts okay so five is divine it has great power and when we're dealing with freedom it's a part of being stoic it's a part of us tapping into our true divinity individuality of our soul passions from the heart okay so it's about letting go of anything else and just focusing on the essence of the soul okay and the soul is nothingness okay it has no weight to it but it is rich and it's eternal okay so if you are in a life path five you're going to be an individual that has a great body of knowledge you like the variety okay you love to travel and adventure 
you are great at multitasking. You could take on like five things at one time. <laughs> It ain't no way for me. I can't do it. Give me, give me at least two. At least two, I'm be good. <laughs> you like to be involved in several activities, doing one thing at a time. Very adaptable, drawn to work, live for the now and in the present moment. Didn't I just say that when you navigating with your five senses? Like these numbers is powerful. And it's just like a strategy. It tells us so much about our personality and ourselves and the energy it holds. Just like the planets and astrology do. I love doing the numerology numbers and the life paths. It's just like give me so much positive energy. Because it resonates exactly with the being. The celestial body like. Okay. So as I was saying you live in a present moment and that's how you create beautiful things present moment okay the dark and the unknown and connecting with those five senses you're going to create beautiful things creative creative ideas manifestations it's going to put you right in the middle of law of attraction you're going to be be able to bring things forth like that okay you are a truth seeker you are search for knowledge like you seek for that knowledge and wisdom you think outside the box you strive um you have a great sense of humor okay you connect with your intuitive so you can feel when things are right and wrong okay um you have many talents that you take out so you're very creative every um this whole sash energy Every sage that I have connected with have beautiful energy, great sense of humor, and they are very creative beings. Like They like to create things, and they do have different tasks that they take on, and they see forth to them, too. Very disciplined and balanced, okay? You do not like being pent down. You love your freedom, and it connects with that Gemini energy, um also you connected with the communication and mercury that intellect because it's about a higher learning higher knowledge when we're dealing with mercury communication social as well okay so um sometimes it be kind of hard for you to find one person to connect with you connect with a lot of people but you like a variety you like different individuals to like stimulate you in different areas okay and there's nothing wrong with that because that's the energy that you hold it's just the energy okay so what you have to do is since you always is like a truth seeker you search for pleasures and you don't want to act out of pleasure you want to be more into your heart space of love okay and acting out of positivity and not searching and seeking for pleasures because you're not going to be fulfilled with that you're going to have to fill your heart space up with love and do things out of love to keep a balance okay so you like basically have that restless energy okay you like to bounce from job to job <laughs> your mind's always racing you had that gym gemini energy always moving and that's just the type of energy you hold like you like to take on adventures but you're a huge hustle you love to hustle and make money you good at making money you consistent with energy flow okay finding a career to express yourself and having a expressive outlet because you have a lot of powerful energy you multitask you do a lot you expressive okay you brighten up individuals day okay you have that energy where they always are navigating towards you because you just like one of those cool people to be around like that leo energy people love being around leo energy they automatically feel safe they feel love and they just drawn to you because you are so smart like you just have that body of knowledge okay but you love to experience a lot of things with your senses because you connected with those five senses so it's like 
you don't want to get caught up in the pleasures okay you want to not be in dopamine okay dopamine is the pleasures where you is constantly always seeking 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 for pleasures just like for an example for an addiction for as cake or something like that you want to keep on seeking and seeking and seeking for it and it's like no good for you so for an example the neurotransmitters you keep on seeking for the pleasures and they die out okay so you getting more and more and more but you're getting less and then they continue you continue to get more and more and more and it's going to be nothing there of the neurotransmitters now if you operate out of serotonin that's the happy hormone okay and it's something that is not taken like dopamine is taken from you from the pleasures is something that's given so if you take the great intellect that you have and you be of service to the collective consciousness they're going to automatically navigate to you okay and it's going to be out of love okay and you're going to attract people and that's going to have your happy hormone you're not seeking for anything but you are receiving the power of love okay and you're happy you fulfill that way more better okay so you have to be disciplined just because you operate more out of those five senses to say okay if I'm over indulging too much, for an example, and drinking too much soda, okay, just just an example. Well, I have to set a plan and a schedule and get more organized where I'm not drinking this soda. You have to be organized to set up the plan. Just because we have a tendency, if we are doing something, if we are connected with those five senses, and we, it's just like... A bad habit that we take on in order to get rid of that bad habit we have to change it with a positive pattern to help us to release the bad habit okay so that means we have to get structured and do something positive to erase that no good habit that we indulge in and that's basically what you have to do you have to take some time out get a planner and say okay this is not life recharging okay and i keep it's just like for an example the casino i keep going and i keep putting my money in the machine and it keep taking and taking and taking but i'm not receiving anything back okay that's an imbalance that's what dopamine do okay and that's a pleasure so you want to connect with the serotonin to say okay i'm balanced i'm not over indulging in anything okay i'm being of light to the collective consciousness and the power is being amplified the love the positivity my creativity my abundance of wealth is being amplified back to me because i'm being of service i'm operating out of love and i'm not over and indulging but i'm being of service to the collective consciousness that's your sole purpose okay so you basically have the energy and we have highs and lows and all sign where you crave for stability okay so it's great for you to take on things where you not overindulging in your pleasures and be able to set a daily routine up in order to keep you of balance that's all okay so you have to take the beautiful intellect the creativity the multitask like the adventurous mind and you have to take the hustle the drive the passion like you got so much beautiful energy in you you have to be able to take it and express it out okay and then when we think of mercury energy it's the fast planet it moves quick so you connect it with that energy so just find balance and not over indulge in anything okay because you can get stuck and addicted to pleasures and over indulging just because you resonate with those five senses so just make a plan up 
and just take the beautiful things that you have inside of you and express them outwards because we all have our highs and lows in these numbers and we have things that we need to work on to help us to ascend to a high frequency of love and we have things that we have to release that no longer serves us and add on things that's life charging for the being 15 15 on the clock the powers amplified in five so just be mindful that your sole purpose is going to be of service to the collective consciousness you are a teacher because you have a great intellect okay you fun to be around you love to wear bright colors okay but you also don't like to be controlled at all okay and you seek for freedom okay so take the knowledge take the five senses and be great and help humanity five 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 on the clock i love you all sending you all positive energy and high vibes and i'll be back with more i love you peace and love